What's up guys and welcome to Nutero. I am the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the love spread for somebody. So let's see who's gonna get it. Taurus. What's up Tar Tar? Thank you so much for being here. I hope you guys are doing beautifully well today. So let's see what's going on between you and your person. I'm gonna do a love spread and then we're gonna clarify. <coughs> Taurus. Who are we dealing with a Virgo? All right, what's the relationship as of now between Taurus and their person? You have the Ten of Pentacles. Wow. Some of you guys could be creating a family with this person or you're about to. You guys both feel like this is very solid, very stable. Like, you guys both feel like you guys are both on the same page as to building and creating a type of abundance with, this, with each other. That's nice. How does Taurus feel? The Hermit in Reverse. You feel like they're not holding themselves accountable for something. Uh, how do they feel? Could be a Virgo. Um, the Ace of Cups. They want to do. So, they want a new leap of faith here. They want to open this chapter up with you. They have. They want a new beginning of love. Okay. What is the obstacle? You have the Emperor. It could be an Aries. Um, someone wanting to control the situation. What should Taurus do? Uh, the Ten of Cups in reverse. There's some type of unhappiness that you're dealing with or an unhappy family situation that you got to look at, okay? Um, what's the result? You have the Knight of Wands in reverse. Someone being in and, out, in and out of the situation. The Two of Cups in reverse. There could be a separation that happens. A disconnect. Okay, what is this um, <clears throat> Ten of Pentacles for the relationship as of now? You're the Knight of Pentacles in reverse, the Magician in reverse, and the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Dang. Both, y'all don't trust each other though. Yeah, I feel like both of you guys are playing games here, and that's why you're not nurturing the connection as much as, much as you could. But you know that it could be stable. You know that it could be abundant. The Queen of Swords. But I feel like both of you guys are looking at the situation logically here. Some of you guys could... It's like... It's like, are you guys only together for the family? For the abundance? For the what it could be, right? Dang. I was not expecting that. Okay, what is... um The Hermit in reverse. For how Taurus feels. You have the Queen of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, and the Four of Cups in reverse. You feel like this person matches your fly, matches your style, matches whatever. You know, when it, especially when it comes to financial situation. Like, I feel like, you know, you, you feel like this was your pair here. Um, I feel like what you didn't see coming was that you, you wouldn't want to come. You, you, what you didn't see coming was that you did not want to go towards this person. Because you felt like you guys went together so well. You never saw that you would see it opposite from that. Um, I do feel like um, you feel like they're not holding themselves accountable here for um, not keeping up with, you know, the image or not keeping up with, you know, what you know that you guys could be or not keeping up with the financial part of the relationship. Okay. What is this Ace of Cups here? For how a Taurus person feels. The Knight of Wands in reverse, the Empress in reverse, and the Knight of Wands in reverse. <clears throat> this person is really um, indecisive, okay? They're going to be really inconsistent because they're low-key mad. They are open um, to love for you know to offer you love here but they're not open to nurturing it with the empress in reverse this person has um self-love self-worth um to learn okay so they can only offer you like the beginning stages of love like anything after that like solidifying it or like making it concrete or to like nurture it and you know massage the soil they can't do that okay they, they're not going to be consistent whatsoever right now because they're still learning how to love themselves how to take care of themselves. What is the emperor here for the obstacle? This could be an Aries. That's an obstacle as well. The magician in reverse. The king of swords. The queen of cups. And the four of pentacles in reverse. I feel like um, 
somebody's cutting somebody else off because they feel like they're holding on to something that is not truly what they desire, what they want here, what they've manifested. Okay, I feel like someone still cares about the inner, the other person a lot, but someone is like taking charge and is saying, no, this is not truly what I manifested. This is not, you know, truly what I desire deep down. What is the Ten of Cups in reverse for what Taurus should do? You have the Page of Wands in reverse, the Two of Wands, and the Knight of Wands. I feel like, um... I feel like they don't want you to take a leap of faith with this energy. I feel this energy is going to um, offer you some type of get-together or like they're planning to come towards you. The universe does not want you to go, you know, accept that, okay? I feel this person just wants to have fun here. They're not temperances in reverse. They're not balanced within themselves, okay? So they might like act out irrational or like make decisions or choices that don't make sense. Okay, what is the Knight of Wands in reverse? You have the hangman in reverse, page of swords in reverse, and the three of wands. I feel like <clears throat> ace of cups. Yeah, I feel like you're gonna be closed off to this person and they're gonna keep they're gonna just be waiting for you to hit them up. Waiting for you to hit them up here. They're refusing to change their perspective on the fact that they can't offer you anything until they offer themselves the same cup. You know, but um yeah, I feel like you're gonna see the disconnect between you and this person real quick because they're trying to offer you something that they can't sustain, you know? All right, Taurus, all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this. And stay positive.